scored in the game in Seattle back on December 30th as we are set to go. This one underway on Hockey Night in Canada. Glad to have you with us as Markstrom comes out to play. Nikita Zadorov from his own zone will carry through center. Works the puck into the wing. Here's Lindholm with the shot. That's off the stick of gun. Back towards the corner. Bouncing puck play to front. The shot scores! Chuck and it's one up in Calgary. There wasn't much going early in this first period to the neutral zone for the Calgary Flames. You can see the initial shot goes off Grubauer. He's communicating to his team where it goes. He recognizes it goes to the corner to his left. His teammates not quite quickly enough in time on Lindholm. And then Matthew Kachuk, by the time they realize and go to Lindholm, he's wide open in front. Couldn't find it. By the time he saw it, it was in his feet, and Lindholm was able to feed it out in front. Bingo. one nothing Calgary. Here's Larson with a shot. Stopped by Larson. His first save of the game. That's three minutes and 45 seconds in. Puck cleared out the center ice. For or at the deadline would be a decidedly unpopular move. How's that for some incisive analysis, Rick? Well done, Scott. Digging deep as always. Everly on the puck behind the net, tried to get it in front, deflected by Markstrom, but here's a chance for Dunn with a shot. Good save, Markstrom. As Vince Dunn sneaking in, lets one go, and Markstrom makes his best save of the first period. And that's one thing you have to watch if you're the Calgary Flames is Vince Dunn, just how active he is. He recognizes the turnover very quickly from Elias Lindholm, and he just goes right at him, steps up into the play in a quick shot. Fernando makes a good pass out of the corner to Appleton, and away he goes. Former Jet with the dump in. Appleton gave it away. And Brian Yarncroke scores! Coughed up right in front of Kelly Yarncroke. Able to fire it home and tie it up at one. Croke goes into double digits and in scoring. And Marksham doesn't stop this initial rim. And then you can see it goes back again. Another rim. And the defense just don't have an opportunity to see who they have. Appleton dropped it off. That's picked off, and the Flames work it in. Mangiapane over to Coleman. Coleman shoots. Grubauer save. Rebound loose. And it winds up in the corner. Backlund plays it back to Hannafin. Michael Backlund at the line. Here, nice play to Hannafin in front. Great save by Grubauer. What a stop on Mangiapane. Gets a can across with that line. Man. Was that something or what? And then how about this save? Andrew Mangiapane doesn't maybe get the shot up that he would like, but the net is wide open. And that's something that he's been on Jacob Markstrom about. But talk about details. There's five of them right there yeah, that he works on constantly. He's getting a lot of chances to work on it, too. This is his 14th start the last 15 games. Mangiapane can't quite catch up. Dunn jabs it across to Giordano, who finds Everly on the attack. Check by Backlund. Here's a chance for a breakaway for Gaudreau. Drop the roll on the backhand. Stop by Grubauer as Larson hustled into the play. Gaudreau didn't have much option but to let the backhand go in. Backwards with a little help from Lausanne and then a change. Dunn had gone off. Larson comes off. Up comes all the way across to Coleman. Lost an edge. He goes down and Wenberg takes off the other way with Everly on the rush. And Larson here's Everly. Stop by Larson. Stacks the pads and makes a terrific save. Show you the save by Marsham first. It's a two on one through the neutral zone. Seattle gets it. Wenberg's a passer, and Marsham would know that from his pre scout, but also to Everly, who's the shooter, and he gets over there in time and covers that net. A little two pad stack, if you will. And Johnny Gabriel goes to work behind the net. The shot goes in front. Gabriel got it. Two of them. Shots the nine. Bounces back to Tanev. One timer. Little off the stick line as Jordano got a stick in the way. Oliver Schoenter makes a pass over to Tanev. Ahead to Coleman into the zone. Coleman feeds it across by Giovanni. Stop by Grubauer. Second great look for Giovanni. Grubauer up the challenge, made the save. Long backhand pass. Worked in by Backlund. Shoot, stopped by Grubauer. Coleman on the rebound. Put it through the crease and out the other side. Giovanni back to Grubauer. Line over to play period. the period. Long shot. Stop. Grubauer. Rebound. Steered away from danger by Johansson. Mike Coleman has Donato, been, a, yeah, yeah, been a bit of an agitator. He's going at it with Ryan Donato as period three is underway, and they're still talking to each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The are Coleman's knocked down, back on his feet. Donato's able to spin him around, and he falls, and not much landed in the way of punches, but right off the face off to start the third Blake Coleman and Ryan Donato drop the mitts. And they just keep looking at each other, and 
drives it back to the point. Picked off by Kachuk. Away he goes. Lindholm drives it. Might be a two on one. Kachuk. Lindholm. Back in front. And somehow that speed out of his group. Our scramble back to make the save. It might have been slowed down by Larson. Johnny can throw camp away, but. A subtle little play by Lindholm. But watch him take this puck out wide. It allows more time to crack and go towards him. And it allows that seam to Goudreau to open up. He doesn't feel he's going to get a shot off here. But what a save by Adam Larson, who just bails out his goaltender there. But just a subtle little play by Lindholm. Get, allow more time and space for Johnny Goudreau to get up into the play. Face off won by Wenberg. Flames try to force a turnover in the corner. Wenberg back in the battle. Kachuk winds up with a puck with a play to the line of Tanev. Put shot on goal. Pass save. Lindholm shoots. Scores! On the rebound, Elias Lindholm makes it 2-1 Calgary. Well, and it's right off the faceoff, which Lindholm actually loses, but he gets help from Kachuk, and then he goes in and creates a battle and wins it on his own. It goes from low to high. And Lindholm is on a mission on that chip right there. In on the four check after the lost draw. And there was no way he was going to lose this battle. And I'll tell you, in the commercial timeout, this line was actually out on the ice and was expected to start. Daryl Sutter changed. And it flips it ahead for Coleman. It's like a pretty good bump at the blue line. In time, it's a two on one. Anderson wants a play. Anderson put it Mark Giordano, then he finishes his check. And look at the far part of your screen. It's a two-on-one for the Flames. But Before the through center, Michael Backlund on the wing to Coleman. Here's Anderson with a pass that's denied by Everly. Got to stick it away. Backlund behind the net. Longiponi's in front. Tries a shot up high on Grubauer. Makes the save. Shot gloved down by Backlund. He'll take off with it. Trying to get away from Everly. Backlund in with speed. Now Longiponi. Backlund. He's stuck. This is to add to this lead. Backlund with the tip. Grubauer keeps it a one goal game. Approaching the final two minutes of the third. There's a giveaway. Lucic shoots. Stop by Grubauer. Took a peek. Has it under his arm. Able to freeze the puck for a faceoff. Hand to the bench for a new stick. Giordano threw it in front. Right through the crowd on the other side. Here's McCann again. Shot deflected. Markstrom saved. And the rebound swung away by Tanner. But it was a shooting gallery there for a little while. And that might do it as Tanev's able to bat it out. And the Calgary Flames have won.